second place, followed by Breck and Castro Nevis. Here's what happened that brought out the full course caution. Tora Takagi crowds Max Wilson on the way into turn three. You got to give a guy some racing room. You just can't plow into him and expect him to turn and use him as your girlfriend on the way into the corner. That's just what happened. Here is Tora Takagi. Okay, I'm going to try Max on the outside. Whoa, man. What about the braking part? Well, yeah. <laughs> That's something you want to do when you're trying to slow down from 190 to 40. Whoa. You just try to use your four, not someone else's four. Well, you know, if I can't use my own brakes, I'll use the brakes of the guy in front of me. That was an interesting maneuver. <laughs> oh. So. Parker and I were just wondering if we'd gotten away from the full course cautions for the day and all of a sudden the flag showing in every corner station again. This time it involved Tora Takagi in Oriel, Serbia. Well, this is heading down into turn three and another fine example of how not to use the brakes on a champ car race. Tora Takagi punts Oriel, Serbia. Now watch from the onboard from Tora. They turn into the corner and Tora says, I'll just be hitting you now. And I've gained another spot the hard way. It's amazing that Takagi could continue on after that. After the smack with the wall, there's massive damage on Serbia's car. You would think there'd be damage to the left front of Torres' car. Now watch on the turn-in. Oriel's a little bit wide as he was trying to avoid the car in front of him on the initial turn-in, trying to gain some room. But Torres comes in with just a huge head of steam. Gets Oriel, Oriel way up in the air. Looks like a Joey Chitwood Saturday afternoon event. Heavy damage to the left side of the Sigma Autosports car. See you there, thanks. Well, we got trouble again. This time it's Takagi a and Moreno. <laughs> huh. Same place, too. Well, this time Tor is done. Look at the left front. It is definitely damaged. So, finally, I think he's being put out of his and everyone else's misery. Moreno keeps it running. He's off. So now Tor Takagi is kind of waving like he wants him to move the car. That car is not going anywhere except on the hook. And Jim McGee, who manages for, well, here it is again. <laughs> Another skewer job. Ah, oh, and it looks like he got Tracy on the way by as well. So, uh, if I was Tor, I'd just kind of head for the airport. I don't think I'd stop and say hi to any of the other drivers today.